I'm going to use exercise one in tutorial four to illustrate how to do a t-test comparing the mean of a sample to a hypothetical value. In that particular exercise, we have the claim that the population mean in the effluent is four parts per million. And we have a set of six observations to use to test that idea. Now we can state the null hypothesis here as the mean of the population is equal to 4.0 or putting it in symbols, mu, the mean is equal to 4.0. I need to start by calculating summary statistics and I've done that with my calculator. I have the mean is equal to 4.9, the variance is equal to 5.92 and the number of observations is equal to six. So I can start now using the formula for t. t is equal to 4.9, take away the hypothetical value four, divided by the standard error. Now the standard error is given in the statistical manual as the square root of the variance divided by the number of observations. So we've got the square root of 5.92 divided by 6 and I've worked that out to be 0 0.99. So I can add that to the formula over here and we get 4.9 take away 4 divided by 0 0.99 or 0 0.9 divided by 0 0.99 gives us a t value of 0 0.91. Now we need degrees of freedom. They're calculated for this test as n minus 1, 6 minus 1, or 5. So we've calculated t, 0.91, df of 5. So we need to go to the statistical tables to find the relevant value. For degrees of freedom equal to 5, we go across this row, and we need the 0 0.05 column for a two-tailed test. So that gives us a value of 2.571. Our t calc is equal to 0 0.91, which is less than t table. So we can accept the null hypothesis. On the evidence we have, the mean of the sample is equal to 4.0.